Realtek Global Fund One is the first and only Japanese venture capital fund that sorely invests into Southeast Asian deep tech startups trying to solve societal and environmental issues in the region. Singapore is a country that is depending 90% of its food supply via import and is trying to become more self-sufficient. Shiok Meats is one of its kind cultivated meat and seafood company who is tackling this challenge. Malaysia has a large agriculture and palm oil sector that is very much dependent on manual labor. Aerodyne is addressing this by developing a drone-based precision agriculture solution. In Indonesia, we have invested in a company called Jala that has an IoT and machine learning technology which helps shrimp farmers to maximize the farm efficiency and sustainability. What we're doing now is we're making an off-the-shelf cell therapy which will make cell therapy accessible for everyone. So I think that's an impact, a societal impact that we're having with this technology. The food business should be digitized and um, then I looked into robotics and how can and with mobile technologies ordering payments on mobile app and then if we can then combine that and make it a seamless cashless um, transaction and that's how Ella was born. So what we've developed is a robust membrane that can take temperature, chemicals and uh, basically it can work in harsh conditions for uh, doing the chemical separation and it has an amazing performance. The research they are doing is solving an issue but it's difficult to scale up. We can uh, introduce them to our LP base or the Japanese companies to build out uh, the scale-up uh, facilities, the factories, that's one point. The other part is also to give access to the Japanese market. We won the competition, we were the grand winner of Tech Planter 2018 and that allows us to meet out with Marusan and some of the very committed individuals. They have been helping us to access to the Japan market. After working with the people from Lee Finesse and Real Tech Fund, we know that they are very pro-startup and pro-entrepreneurs and they are always willing to help us. They have brought to us many Japanese corporations which need help as well. Uh, we got to know Live Nest, we got to know Real Tech, and I think that experience of um, sharing with us the best way for us to interact with the corporate partners, um, sharing with us uh, what's the best way to engage some of the clients, gave us a very good head start. A startup itself cannot also build something great and huge and solve a, a world issue just by itself. It also needs to be supported by corporates like here in Japan. This bridge, we believe that it, it's the key fundamental way of moving the world forward and, and solving issues in Southeast Asia that we really wish to do so. This experience makes my career and perspective uh, change drastically. Uh, when I meet uh, startups in Southeast Asia, I can feel that they are facing some challenges such as scaling up and uh, entering into Japanese market. And these are the things uh, which Japanese company like Ebara can contribute. Real Tech Fun is still in the middle of this great journey, but we're also thrilled to tackle all these global issues with technology. And now, you are the one to change the world with us.